up y'all so today is falcons game day is the first game of the season and i don't think we're going to be able to watch it because we don't have cable here but anyways i'm in the process of making them file right now which i did a video on it it probably will be up before this video so if it is i'll have it linked in the cards up here but i was peeling some eggs and i need some tips on how to peel eggs because sometimes these eggs be turning out like this Y'all see how funky this is? Like half the eggs missing already. I hate, I hate peeling eggs. So how do we get eggs? You know how the membrane or whatever sticks to it? So if you guys have any tips on how to peel eggs so that's perfectly peeled, please let me know. So comment below and let me know. That's why I really cook, hate cooking hard boiled eggs because peeling it is so freaking hard. But we're about to have some leftover cathedral in a little bit. I'm about to heat that up and there's a super simple way to heat up cathedral for one person and I'm going to show you guys how to do that and it's a little trick that uh, I saw my, one of my cousins doing this like a couple years ago and I've been doing it ever since and it's so easy to eat cathedral for one person y'all I just finished making them bao and it turned out so good I mean it doesn't look that appetizing but it's really good so my mom had some more of that dough so I'm going to get some more dough and then uh make some more the most time consuming part is the dough like I had to knead it for like 20 minutes and stuff it was just really tiring but anyways so if you guys like i said before i'm gonna have a link somewhere and i'm about to heat up this cathedral like i said i was going to show you how to heat it up for one person but there's two of us eating daniel's eating too so i'm not going to be able to show you that but it's super easy so what you do is you get a small pot and you heat the soup up in that pot Make sure it comes to a rolling boil, just enough soup for one bowl, okay? So the trick is knowing the ratio between bowl, uh, how much soup you need. Because you normally, after you make a deal, after you straw everything, you put the soup on there. So it's kind of, if you're first doing it, it's going to be hard for you to know how much soup you need. But anyways, just put a little bit of soup in a small saucepan, bring it to a rolling boil, and then you cook your noodles in there. Um, and it takes a little bit longer for noodles to cook if you cook it this way. So just taste it as you go and then that's all you have to do cook the noodles in the soup and that's it it's super easy so anyway spot heat this cathedral now oh guys i'm so stuffed from eating all that cathedral now i gotta make more than pao well i just want to make it for the freezer honey i should have just made freaking breakfast burritos like i did that one time because that job was easy so those breakfast burritos and he, daniel loved that too so i should have made that said i'm over here spending all day making them pao I just went to my mom's house just to deliver some of bao. Now I got two more bags that I need to make. But the hardest part is just this part. Actually, putting it in the roll wrapping and stuff is so hard. <sighs> Anyways, let's get to work on this. This dude right here, been watching Cobra Kai or whatever for like two days. And I keep on asking him, what the hell is Cobra Kai? And he kept on saying, it's a dojo. I'm like, I don't know what that is. And he kept on like, not making it clear what Cobra Kai is. And they keep on saying the word Cobra Kai in this show. So I asked him again, what the hell is Cobra Kai? He said, it's a dojo. And he knows damn well, I don't know what a dojo is. What's a dojo, babe? Karate gym. And he said, I need to go watch Karate Kid. Karate Kid. Psh, I'm not about this kind of show. Oh, time to continue with this cooking. And I don't want to because I'm so tired. Like I'm exhausted from doing all this, making all this no bao. Now I gotta make more eggs. I'm trying to make 20 more no bao. It wouldn't be so tiring if I had um, enough filling to begin with. I may not feel like I've had enough myself. If I begin with, then I probably would have been done by now, but I didn't, so now I got to get cooking on the rest of this. Just got done. Got some more steaming in there. I got these look so much better than the ones I made for the video. I had to break that one open so I can see if the meat inside was cooked. But this is another 11 numpaos and they're really big. This is what the filling looks like on the inside. There's sausage and Chinese sausage and egg at the very bottom. Then I just got home and I just got us some chipotle. It's so heavy, it's like a pound of food. This gotta be like a pound. 
I got a food scale. Let's measure it. Let's weigh it. I mean, I guess I don't eat too much of it. All right, let's see how you use this thing. Dang! No, oh, that's in that's fluid ounce. You can't measure pounds in here. Gram, milliliter, ounce. Okay, pound. Oh, 1.14 pounds. Let's see how much Daniel's weigh. His is heavier. His is one point, I don't know. Anyways, these are heavy. Thanks for getting food, babe. I got What are you doing? Maybe you don't open your food? Oh, are you recording? Ooh, you guys. Let me tell you a trick of how to get lots of food from Chipotle. First, uh, you need to get lots of lettuce, lots of, just ask for extra things, and then you can get, ask for um, tortilla on the side, and then you can make like two or three meals out of this. But this is so much food, it's equipped, this is like two or three meals right here. It'll be two meals for me. Oh, you got sour cream in yours, man? Yeah, I got sour cream in yours too. I didn't want sour cream. My bad. You gotta love it. <laughs> you better scoop some of it out. Mmm, so good. Can you your bowl? You better scoop some of it out. It's been so long since we had Chipotle. I know. It's been a really long time. I don't think we had all year. Yeah, we have. Uh, yeah, we have. We went to the one in Jimmy Carter. The one by the Starbucks? I hope you know how you know that. No. I got a chicken burrito bowl. Actually, is it called a burrito bowl if you don't get a burrito? I don't know. <laughs> chicken bowl with fajita, veggies, white rice, um, Fire roasted corn salsa, fresh roasted, no, it's fresh up. Fresh tomato, salsa, cheese, lettuce, and then Daniel put some sour cream on mine, which I did not want no sour cream. Can I have it now? Can't take it off, honey. You bought your order. Anyways, we're gonna enjoy our dinner. I was gonna get some chips and salsa, but I decided not to. Y'all look, this is the. What are you doing? You're not putting it. Why would you even think about doing that? Anyways, she was about to take a McFlurry and put it in a microwave. It's so hard. Why would you put it in a microwave? To defrost it a little bit. That's not how you. Anyways, this is the McFlurry that we got from that McDonald's videos that I posted like two weeks ago. And it's still good. I'm just joking. This is the next day after we bought this. If it was two weeks later, it would be probably really nasty. You know what? We shouldn't have left a spoon in here, probably. We probably should have covered it, too. I just wiggle it out. They don't come out. I can't believe you put this in, right in there and didn't cover it. Oh. Here, I got a spoon out for you. I got that milk. We're getting to the bottom of this McFlurry and it's only vanilla ice cream at the bottom. They did not mix it well enough. I guess, again, they were too lazy again. I gave Daniel the bright idea of getting Neapolitan ice cream and just putting these cookies on top. It's gonna be the same thing as the McFlurry. Now these cookies we just had sitting around because this is a giant thing to finish. Just I want to see you try it honey and see if it tastes good. What do you think is gonna be good? Oh yeah. It's, uh... That looks really good. Are you making an ice cream cookie now? Yeah, mini ice cream cookie. Or is it called cookie sandwich? Ice cream sandwich? Mm. Oh that's what and you got strawberry? That's your favorite too. Mm-hmm. You want to make you one? No. I don't want that. Try it. 
I gotta finish this McFlurry right here. Right, vanilla. <sighs> Flurry. It's gonna focus. Auto focus on this camera so ass. Anyways, guys, my back hurt, my arm hurt, just from standing up all day and cooking all that nonpal. I made um, I ended up making how many nonpal? So I got twenty. I have twenty in the freezer. Thirty two nonpals took me. It wouldn't have taken all day if I had the masala mix from the get go, but it took long time to make all those on bow but anyways what i was doing with it or the reason why i made such a large batch is because i am freezing it for daniel for breakfast so i saran wrapped each one individually and i put it in a freezer bag or like a freezer ziploc bag and then and hopefully it'll be good i never had frozen on bow so i don't know how it's gonna turn out but hopefully all my efforts did not go to waste so I guess the day before he eats it, I will take it out and let it sit in the fridge and then overnight. Then he can put it in a microwave the day he eats it. So hopefully it's still good. And I'm really exhausted. It's like I'm out of breath right now. All right. Anyways, I'm going to end the vlog here and call it a day. Just going to see here. My husband's probably going to watch Cobra Kai because he's been watching that for like the past two days. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching my videos, for liking, for commenting. Please comment, guys. Please like. Please subscribe if you haven't. I would love it if you guys interacted with me so I can get a feel some feedback from y'all on what you like and don't like about my videos and stuff like that and how I can improve. Um, but yeah, and what content would you guys like to see? Because sometimes I run out of ideas of what to record and stuff because it's the same thing over and over but anyways thank you guys so much for supporting my channel i really appreciate it and i'll catch you guys in the next one bye